Did you know that there are different types of level 3 bulletproof glass? Well, in this video, Wade from US Bulletproofing and I take a look at three different types to show you the difference. Wait, I got three samples on the table now, so this is different. Um, what, what's the difference here? What am I looking at? So essentially what you're looking at are level three sample window samples that we're going to be testing, but the difference is the glass makeup. So this particular one right here, we have an all glass makeup. We also have a GCP or the glass clad polycarbonate, okay. and then we have an insulated glass clad polycarbonate here as well. Okay, so we just went over uh, all glass. We just went over polycarbonate. You kind of told me a little bit of the differences. This is indoor, this is outdoor and all sorts. But now I got IG on the table. So what, what's going on here? So yes, absolutely. So essentially we are adding a couple of different factors here to enhance the overall building envelope system. So not only on top of the security, but with the insulated factor on the glass makeup, you've got a quarter inch air pocket there as well. You could certainly add inner layers of solar band into the glass makeup as well to offer a additional solar reflectance. Okay, so this is a, a, basically just an IG unit with your added protection onto it. Yes. So we can use regular solar or low E coatings on here and it adds all that performance to this. Thing. Yes, added additional performance of the overall fenestration system, yes. And we're shooting all of these with what? We're shooting all three of these with a 44 Magnum from 15 feet away, three shots. Okay, so they're all rated the same. They're yes. all level threes, we're shooting them the same. Are we expecting the same results out of all three of them? Yes, essentially we're expecting the same results out of all of them. Again, the glass to absorb the overall projectile being shot at it three times, but yes, okay. you should have the same performance out of all three of these samples. Well, this should be exciting. We'll be able to compare them side by side and really see the results of this right here. All three products, different, but kind of the same. Yep. All right, well, let's go shoot these ones. So we, we shot them. It looks like they performed great. Can you uh, kind of tell me, that, is this what we expected to see? This is exactly what we expected to see. Again, that these impacts are, the glass is absorbing the actual impact. Cause again, you do have the all glass system right here. Yep. You have GCP or the glass clad polycarbonate and you have the insulated 
glass clad polycarbonate, but they're all to meeting the level three ballistic graded standard. So I, I have to talk a little bit about this one right here because mm -hmm. it looks scary from the outside, right? You have that piece of single quarter inch on the front and then the space because it was an IG. Yes. So the, the first piece is, is obviously collapsed because it's just a piece of quarter inch. It, it, all the protection is happening after that. Correct, it's all happening. It's essentially the entire system, but the main protection is happening after that airspace. But yes, it will break that outboard quarter inch light and then all the protection comes from the inner laminates. So that is completely to be expected the way it is. That's Absolutely. why you're using a tempered piece of glass in case there's any glass falling or anything like that. Correct, exactly. Very right. cool. All right, well, let's keep going.